children want to learn, but they, some they don't have chance. Some they are poor, but they know they want to have a good education because of the parents have bad income. They are not rich and they have no land, they have no income, it's quite hard. So they want to learn English means they want to have a better future life. Tomato Village Learning Center is a local initiative that Philanthropy Connections has supported since 2014. The project has been running for over 10 years and has supported more than 200 students in being better equipped with good English skills. When you have a good education by English, you have a good chance or a good step to work in any job, in, like in a shop or in a work in a factory. I want to let the people know how to speak, read and write in English in this area. Philanthropy Connections is a non-profit organization dedicated to support local organizations and initiatives whose goals are to empower local people in vulnerable situations. The Tomato Village Learning Centre is an excellent example of the kind of projects that we like to support. This is typically a project that helps the local community, in this case ethnic minorities, to be able to get the tools that will help them to improve their lives. We have uh, five tribes here, so they are all in five tribes in our school. We are teaching English to the Hill Tribe students. They are with Rekaren, Badongkaren, Shan, Bao, and Mong. The students from the mountains, they have uh, no experience, no education, and they have not a good life. Even for the parents, they have no good income. <laughs> The Tomato Village Learning Center is just one example of what we as an organization can do. This is a great school that because of our support has been able not only to continue but even to grow. Many of the kids that graduated from Tomato Village have been able to score higher in school and they are able to get into university. Looking for the future, I want to see them that they are going to be a teacher or a nurse or a doctor or a prime minister. This is not easy for the mountain people or students in Mehong San, but our students, they can do it. I started the organization when I became aware of the fact that there are many local initiatives and projects that do excellent work for the communities. They are finding local solutions to local problems, but I found out that it was very, very difficult for them to find help from outside because they don't have a network, they don't speak the languages. We try to find the funds that will help them to do their work even better or to continue doing their work.